Tonight, Eyewitness News is giving you a first look inside the former resort in the Poconos that's been transformed into a Buddhist World Peace Center. The new owners want this to be a place the community can enjoy again. Eyewitness News reporter Brianna Strunk joins us live now from Middle Smithfield Township to show us around. Brianna. Well, Mark, the Jinyan Temple will hold its first public prayer ceremony here tomorrow. The goal is to promote kindness and love while deepening the friendship between Chinese and Americans. This shiny new statue of Buddha greets drivers on Milford Road. A sign, the Jinyan Temple of Sino Esoteric Buddhism is open. Inside, you'll find these 20 foot tall statues weighing three tons each. The prayer hall is adorned with elaborate statues shipped from overseas. Our aim here is uh, to build a temple, as you see, to pray for world peace. The main Jinyin Temple is in China, and this is the first location in America. Temple leaders toured other potential locations, including in California, but ultimately decided to build here because it would be a challenge. We always build Mandala, our mandala, our temple in the most, you know, in the undeveloped area, I would say, economically undeveloped area. The property's main draw, which once served as Fernwood Resorts Event Center, burnt down last summer. The new owners lost precious artifacts in the fire, but they vowed to continue on. It's a setback, but it's not going to stop us. Later this year, they plan to start offering public classes like meditation, yoga, calligraphy, and kung fu. This is meant to be a place for different cultures and religions to come together as one. We're open to, to local people. You know, we also want to learn from them. The master and other disciples traveled from China to be here. This is their grand vision for the property. A few years, you know, this is going to be a magnet for tourism. Tomorrow's public prayer ceremony begins with sign-in from 1 to 2, followed by prayer and artwork, and then wrapping up with dinner from 5.30 to 6.30. You can expect to leave your shoes and differences right at the door. Live in Middle Smithfield Township, Brianna Strunk, Eyewitness News. Mark. Thanks for that behind-the-scenes look, Brianna. Priests, volunteers, and maintenance crews live on site in the former hotel rooms.